Hey guys, welcome back to another video. I'm Rickmaster Nate and today I have an unboxing video of the LEGO Star Wars Stormtrooper Helmet. So this set retails for $60 and has 647 pieces. I also wanted to mention that this set is recommended for ages 18 and up. The box shows the whole helmet on this really clean black background. Okay, let's get into the box. So here we have bag two, bag one, bag five, bag four, Bag three, stickers, and instructions. Okay, let's get to the speed build. So first, let's take a look at the stand. The outside of it is all black and it's made up of these slope bricks. I also really like this plate that's attached to the bottom of it and it's on a hinge so you can angle it up or down. Now let's take a look at the actual helmet. It's in mostly white and there's some black on the front and there's some gray on the sides and on the back. The eyes and the mouth use a lot of different hinge pieces to get these cool angles. There's also a printed piece right here. And this one by two tile has a sticker on it. And there's also some stickers on these one by four slopes. Right under the mouth, there are some of these Technic pieces. I really like the way that they look. And I like the techniques that were used to get it at this angle. There's a ball joint right there and that's how the tubes are angled like that. I don't like how the face has a lot of different gaps. Like for example, there's a big gap right here in between the mouth section and right in between the eyes. And if you try to push it up and hide that gap, you, there's a smaller one right here that you can see. And I also don't like how there's a gap in between these Technic pieces and this curved brick here. It's still a small gap, but it just kind of bugs me that it's there. On the sides, there are a ton of these slope pieces and there's a slope brick here. And each one of these slopes is offset by half a stud until you get down here, it's just offset by one stud again. I like the use of these pieces in gray here, and I think it looks really cool. And I especially like the way that these Lego gold bars were used in gray. The back is very simple. It's just mostly these layered plates and some slopes. And there's some angled plates in dark gray right here and here and there's a 1x2 grill on top of it on each side. The top looks really, really smooth and clean. 
and I really like the way that it looks even though it only uses a bunch of layered plates instead of using slopes like these. On the bottom, there are a lot of plain white bricks and there's a giant hole right here, but it's not visible when you... But it's not visible when you display it on its stand like that, so it doesn't bother me that it's there. And you can't remove the stand from the helmet, unlike the Boba Fett helmet set, because there are some Technic pieces that are holding it in place, and there are also just a lot of other pieces that are on top of it and connected to the helmet, so you just can't remove it without taking off a bunch of other pieces inside the helmet. That's going to be it for today's video. I really enjoyed this set and I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please like, subscribe and hit the bell icon. Also, leave a comment down below. Thanks for watching. Bye.